You know what? I'm, I'm sick and tired of these things. Just always in my way. I'm tired of being poor. I have $50. All these games making me work every day is just yet another disappointment. Oh dear lord. Th this is- this is a lot of steps. Enter world name. You cannot change your world name after this step. Would you like to proceed? Absolutely. Everything is awful. There we go, perfect. Oh, and we get like full character customization too? Okay, yeah, let's <laughs> let's make them nice and yep, just like that, perfect. Gotta change the skin color to something more fitting. Yep, you know, that that's great. That's, yep, that's exactly what I want. Let's change the eye color to a more brown look. Yeah, you know what, that, that's, yeah, that's fine how it is, I guess. Give them some nice brown eyebrows too, why not? And let's make them bold. Yep, perfect, looking great, buddy. You're almost done. And we'll give you some, like, old man lines, yeah. And what voice do we want? <laughs> oh, yep, that sounds good. Perfect. All right, so welcome to, uh, welcome to Fay Farm. It's a farming sim with magic and, um, other things. Yeah, I haven't played this yet, so here we go. And please keep in mind, I, uh, <laughs> I skipped the tutorial, so kind of going in this a little bit blind, not gonna lie. So it wants me to build this and put it down somewhere, so I guess I'll just shove it right back here. Okay, what, 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 it, wall decor, huh? What? Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna try. And I should be able to... Home options, here we go. Uh, rename, there we go, perfect. Nope, Homestead's the wrong name. My Swamp. There we go, looks great. Um, if you haven't gathered yet, um, my dude is Shrek. I, I, I am modeling and living the life as Shrek, so, uh, keep that in mind. So, you know, Shrek is just gonna do what he does, does best, and, uh, you know, clean up the area around, you know, get this farm going. If that's what I'm supposed to be doing, I, I honestly don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I know the little tool tip over there says go talk to Alarek, but uh, I'm a little busy. I'll get to it eventually, maybe. Oh god, okay, that that was quick. Um, okay, so um, I guess I need to craft one of the, like a, a cooking fire. Here we go, I need more stone, which I can't get. So you know what, I'm just gonna go to sleep, why not? That's the end of today. The, you know, this is my swamp. I gotta set things up. Actually, I can set this stuff down, right? Just do a nice little square here. Yeah, what do I plant here? I have seeds? Do I have seeds? Oh yeah, there we go. Perfect, wonderful. I can put those away now. Oh, that was all of them. Okay, never mind. All right, now that we have a, a proper farm going, you know, and we have, you know, our swamp and our little couch stool thing here, you know, things are going well. Not too bad. All right, it's the next day. Um, my stamina is increased. You know, I'll take it. More in, more stamina means the longer I can work on my little farm here. What is this? A rug. Cool. So I'm just gonna clear out the farm, do a little deforestation. My favorite pastime. And now I can make the cooking fire. So we'll put that right there, and we can actually cook some of the greens. Yeah, cook them all, so we can have some food, finally. So that means if I run out of stamina by working too hard, I can, you know, keep going for a little bit. So sometimes, when I get sent game keys, you know, I always question why the developers would ever think it's a good idea to send me something, of all people. Like, do they not really watch what I put out? Because if they watched what I make, you know, they, they wouldn't be sending me game keys at all. They would just be like, oh, not again, this guy got a clay pot, sick. But they would just be like, oh no, not this guy again. No, no, don't send him keys, please. All he does is shit on our work. And you know, that's not true. You know, I'm having a good time right now, gotta say. It still is a mistake that you sent me a key though. What is that, is that a shiny frog? Can I catch that? It's so fast. Am I doing this wrong? How do I get the shiny frog? Get the, get, what? There, Jesus, I got a rainbow frog, okay. What can I do with that? Exactly, why was it so hard to catch compared to the butterfly? What does it, e what does it mean? It's gotta mean something. The deep dark lore of Fae Farm. You know, 
I'm glad I did it. Puts me ahead of the curve, you know? Makes me see things from a different angle. Time in Fae Farm is fleeting. And you must collect and do what you must to survive. What am I even talking about? So I have a fishing rod, right? Can I fish and then use fish for food? Is that a thing I can do? Come on, buddy. You know you want this. There you go. Nope, nope, nope. You're, get you're getting in my stomach. You know that? You you're just making things difficult for both of us. Thank you. And I should be able to just cook it, right? Yeah, we get charred fish. Prepare that. Absolutely. Prepare both these two. Yeah, more food. Thank you. Oh, I found a shiny fish. Is this a shiny fish? Does it seem like it cares for my fishing rod? Oh, there it goes. Oh, got him. Got him, got him. Why are you so shiny? Why was there a shiny frog and now a shiny fish? God fucking damn it. You know what? I'm just gonna go for this one. Nice and simple, you know? You're gonna go in my stomach one way or another. Doesn't matter if you want to or not. This is inevitable. Gonna cook you up nice and fresh. Yum, yum, yum. So I'm just gonna finish this up and I'm gonna keep the food I've made for tomorrow, because honestly, yep, there it is. I can't be bothered, so we'll see what happens in the morning. All right, brand new day, brand new me, you know? We gotta start thinking about big business, you know? We gotta think about our future. We, we can't make money unless we grow crops and sell, I'm guessing, fish as well, and you know, we'll get to that. But these things take time. They take a few days, all right? So for now, I'm just gonna keep digging, keep cutting down trees, because you know what? Trees are an eyesore. And I don't want to see them here. They're worse than weeds. They're like tall weeds. I don't go outside very often. Berry? Oh, we got some- Oh my god, so many berries? Bet you I can cook these too! Make a nice little meal. Alright, now it's time to cut down the last tree in this place. Except for the big ones, because I can't, because I don't have a strong enough tool or whatever. These games like to, you know, pull on you To make you upgrade your shit. But, uh, I think it's time to kind of, you know, go out. Adventure a little bit. Gather some more materials. Go find Alarak or whatever his name is. Hey, yo, what's up, dude? Are you the one I'm supposed to talk to? All right, so all he wanted was for me to now go down to the beach, grab some mussels, and then deliver some broiled shellfish to him. All right, there, I got your broiled shell. What the fuck is happening up there? You know what, I'm not, not even worried. I'm not gonna touch it, so it can't touch me. How the hell do I get a water? I'm in- I'm stuck. Alright, dude, I got your shellfish. So now he wants me to defeat thorns with him tomorrow? Why- why not now? I just gave you the food! You should be full of energy, my guy! Fine, you know what? I'm just gonna go fishing. I'm gonna make some money. I'm tired of being poor. I have fifty dollars. Wait, oh, simple fishing. Th has this been- Has this been here the entire time? Come on. Let's see what- See what happened. Nope, that- that did, um, fuck all. You know what, just turn that back off. It- it made me upset. It doesn't work the way I thought. I thought it would, like, auto-catch for me, but no. It just lost me two shiny fish. I was gonna cook them, eat them. Gobble them, even. Come on, buddy. Come on. Nope, nope. I'll just keep doing that, how about that? Nope, I got the strat! I got the strat! <laughs> it's freaking out! Well, I think it- what the fuck is this? Emerald seal. Okay, no thanks. Can I, like, cut this down? The sickle isn't strong at- okay, you know what? I'm just trying to build more furniture so I can get more stamina, alright? And if you are gonna make things difficult, then I'm just not gonna do it at all. How about that? Oh, what is it? Saltwater mines? Okay. Guess we come here later. That's oh, another one of these things? Citrine seed- what? Do I even do with that? What is this? Oh, there's like a black smoke here. It's stopping me from going there. Wait, so you have wands, right? At this, like, training area? But the only way I can get a wand is if I help the Oler guy tomorrow morning? Why can't I just get one now? Again, I gave it- I gave the fucking soup to him in the morning. And he was just like, mmm, good soup. We meet tomorrow. What? Just keep- just let me have the stuff now, please. All these games making me work. Every day is just yet another disappointment, just like I am to my parents. So how do I make drink beverage station? Oh, yeah, of course. Yep. Okay. I'll just shove that in the corner, or it just freaks out. There we go. Ooh, gives me plus 20 energy? Hell yeah. Okay, so just in the morning, like, it, he just gives it to me anyway. Like, I don't, no quest, no nothing. All right, so now we're gonna have lots of stuff for energy. 
I have six drinks with me, so we're good on drinks. Now we gotta return back to this freaking nerd. Hey, what's up, dude? Remember me? Thanks for the staff, I guess. All right, so I finally made some money from that quest, so I, I now own funds. I no longer just have $50, so let's see what we can buy here. Inventory up. Yep, that's... And I'm back down to 50 bucks. Cool. <laughs> oh, I can buy it. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, that looks just like, just like Shrek. Yeah, put that on. Yeah, looking good, buddy. So uh, I was going through the like the little friends tab here just to kind of figure out like where everybody is and um, explain to me what what is this or this? What 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 am I looking at here? Exactly. There's three of them and I can romance them. You know, I'm just gonna not ask questions. I I've learned to stop doing that. Because if I start asking questions, you know, people are going to start asking me questions about why I'm asking questions. So I just accepted a quest, which is a part of all these, like, farming sim games. Where they're just like, hey, go out there and make friends. You're new to this town, right? Maybe, maybe you need to, like, learn some friendship or whatever. And honestly, I currently and will not be bothered. Like, if it happens, so be it. But I'm not... It... it I'm not gonna go for it. I'm not gonna try. All right, so now the game wants me to go down to the fisherman named Eddie and talk to him about something. And honestly, I think I was supposed to have met these people a long time ago when I did the tutorial, but I didn't do that. So, uh, hi. So, uh, yeah, he, he literally is just like, people are too scared to fish or whatever. So can you please sell fish in the market? We just need three. So I kind of have to do this. And I guess I just end the day, I suppose. I haven't watered my crops in three days. I only got 75 coins for that. Selling a shiny fish and two other fish was only 75. Shrek is a little angry at the moment. Gotta say. All right, so after he's, you know, happy with me f tending to the fish problem, now he wants me to go meet these people, like the ranchers. What the, there we go. I can get rid of these now. Go on. Get out of here. Also, can I ask, what kind of animals are these? Like, these are like rat sheep. So she wants me to buy a chiku. Okay, let, let's let buy a chiku. Into, and oh, this is a bad idea for them. Pissy wissy. <laughs> Absolutely, it worked. <laughs> they blocked like five of the other names I tried, but they didn't block pissy wissy. Okay, come on, buddy. You follow me, right? Yep, come on. Home for me, not really a home for you. Uh, register buddy, there we go. Okay, pissy wissy. <laughs> Very cool. All right, so after I told them that I put the chicken into its coop or whatever, now they want me to feed it? Starting to like this game less and less. You really expect me to take care of my animals? No, sir. Not in this lifetime. You know what? I'm, I'm sick and tired of these things. Just always in my way. I don't even know what's up here. I just want to get rid of these things. Every time they pop out of the ground, it makes a loud fucking noise and I'm tired of it. How do I feed you? I can pet you. Okay, Shrek really likes to pet. Got it. Yeah, that's it. That's all I have to do. Okay. Now that I've finished that little mission, now I can talk to Eddie again and let him know that I've, I've got pets now from his sisters. So I guess doing that, finished that one quest where it's just like, hey, go f get, become friends with people. Good luck. And I honestly don't know what I'm going to get for this. Hopefully it's something worthwhile. I, I think that was literally just for money and that... Okay, and now I get to go meet Cleo, who will give me the key to the mines? It's just that simple, huh? So before she gives me the key to the mines, she wants me to buy a health potion and make five kinds of food. I mean, I have plenty of food at home. I don't know why the hell they want me to make five more. Buy five health potions, I guess? Oh, and I just unlocked the recipes, so I never have to come back here. Cool. And you know what? I honestly can't be bothered. So I'm just gonna cook a bunch of these. Hope that appeases the quest gods, and then we can head into the mine. All right, I got your health potions and food. Can I go in, please? Oh dear lord, Th this is this is a lot of steps. Th it took a real quick turn, didn't it? What seals? What? What are the? Okay, what? Pick up copper or unlock the door. Okay, yep, yeah, we can go in. So it wants me to make a copper seal. Oh, for this. Okay, so do I just start mining? Oh, that takes a while to get- Okay, a lot of stuff just popped up here. Copper ingot, bug juice, is this copper? No, it's coal. Alright, so where do I get copper? So, how do I get through the door? That's... Up there, I can't go through the door. 
It, it's locked. Uncover the switch to unlock the door. Okay, you know what? I didn't ask. I mean, technically I did, but I I meant it facetiously. All right. Oh, it's, oh, okay. Um, I found it. And I heard it open, so I can go to the next floor, right? All right, any, any copper here? Anything besides coal that's new? No. All right, guess I'll go fuck myself. You know, Shrek is just a hardworking man. He's just trying to provide for his family, and these townsfolk are just in his way constantly. Like, you'd think they'd give him a break because his, like, ship crashed, and now he's just kind of here stranded away from home, family, friends. But, uh, the townsfolk honestly couldn't give any less of a shit, because now they're just exploiting Shrek just because he's here. All right, new floor, new me. What do we got this time? Just more coal. Sick. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, is this copper? Oh, it sure is. Give it to Papa. I need to make seals or whatever. Maybe I can use this to craft better tools so I stop wasting so much goddamn time in here. Oh, hell yeah, more copper. What? What is that? What? Enemies. There, there are enemies down here that look like pocket watches. Citrine? What? So how much copper do I need exactly? Because I'd, I'd like to make whatever these copper seals are and see what they're used for, but I also want to make some, like, upgraded tools. Oh, there's some citrine up there. Hell yeah. There we go. Okay. Nice. New new materials. We're getting somewhere. How's that chat? Oh, nope. That's an enemy. Stop. Stop. I'm gonna have to ask you to cease and desist, sir. I don't even want to see how you attack. I'm gonna make sure you can't. There you go. Oh my god, what is- Did I get iron? I did. Oh no, this goes a lot deeper than I thought. So, to progress any further, I need to craft one of these seal crafting stations. And then with that, I can make the seals using the raw materials, but even then, I still don't have enough to make even one seal. So I'm gonna have to go through the mines, like, a lot. Oh, and my turnips, they're all done. Yes, get into my pockets, my sweets. All right, so I'm loaded up on food, <laughs> just a little bit, and uh, we're gonna head into the mine and stay down there all day, because I wanna make sure that I have enough copper to build and make whatever the fuck I need. And you know, if going through the mine a few times is what needs to be done, then I'll do it. It's as simple as that. Oh, okay, yep, on um, floor eight is when things start to get a little interesting. Uh, what the hell is this? Why... Why is everything made out of, like, ship parts? Oh, what's this green? There, there's green things. Peridot? Per Peridot? Peridot? I've gone so far in that I'm starting to see materials that I don't think I need yet. Oh man, yeah, floor ten has, like, Everything. This is this is almost perfect. All right, so now I have to make a stone forge. Put that down, and now I should have enough copper to make pretty much whatever I want. Yeah, I have 108 copper. <laughs> so I need to make four copper seals because it says that it activates the teleporters on floors one through four. So let's just go ahead and craft that. Oh, and the hammered copper seals are for five through eight. Then nine through two. Okay, yep, and then iron seals. All oh, right. What can I make with the four? Oh, I can make glass, make copper ingots, iron ingots, just stone, just bricks. So while the ingots go and the seals are going, I'm just gonna go ahead and go to sleep again, and then we'll go back down to the mine in the morning. All right, so I got my ingots, my copper seals, and my one engraved seal that I have. But for right now, I'm gonna go down to the blacksmith and see if I can't upgrade my gear because I'm in desperate need of upgrades and I love upgrades. Just a hundred florins and one copper ingot? Is that for all of them? Oh, we're getting a full set because if I get like a crap ton of money from iron ingots and I don't get a lot of money for farming, then I'm just gonna not farm. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep mining over and over. So now that I have these seals, I just put them in. This floor can now be teleported to and it opens the door. Okay, so I can just walk through now and let's go ahead and try out the, the new tools. Two hits and it gave me three. Okay, so I get one extra now too. And also one thing I noticed because I slept in my bed last night, uh, stamina hasn't gone down at all. So I can just keep going. And it just takes two hits and that's it. What about you? Two hits? Absolutely. Oh, is this a, is this iron? This has to be iron, right? Ooh, yep, iron, 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 baby. Now we can start upgrading the stupid pickaxe again. Or at least that's what I wanna do. 
Because I have a plan for- I have so much copper. <laughs> oh, what the hell are you, buddy? It's a fucking anchor! Alright, well, I'm out of stamina, and... Honestly, I can't be too bothered, so I'm gonna go back home and make a shit ton of ingots. So I need to make three more of these, and I need to make four iron seals so we can get those floors done and we can teleport to those anytime we want. And then with the rest of the materials, I'm just gonna make a shit ton of copper ingots. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these ingots and then literally just sell them. And then, is there a place I can buy food? Oh, perfect. And what do we got? Plus two mining power, plus two mining efficiency, plus 75 energy. How many of these can I buy? 10? Sold. So I'm down a lot of money, but let's go back in, activate the teleporters, because now I could just teleport to whatever floor now. And then I can take the food, have a buttload of mining efficiency. And from here I can just teleport to nine now? Yeah. Oh, and it tells me what's on each floor. And so in theory, what I'm doing currently should essentially give me unlimited money and unlimited food. And so then I'll just pretty much be able to do whatever the fuck I want. Because all I have to do is just mine copper, sell the copper as ingots, and then I'm guessing with an upgraded pickaxe again, I'll be able to have like four come out of these things? Listen, Shrek is on a mission and I don't need you standing in my way. All right, so now I can teleport to floor 12, no problem. Um, all of my ingots finished, so I'm just gonna add those to the table here. And hopefully, I'll have more than 2,000, because that's how much I spent on food. And if I hit 2,000 or higher, then I know I've made a profit. Alright, so now I'm starting to use the iron seals, and I only ate two of the mining food, and it almost filled me back up all the way, so I also should have better mining efficiency. Yeah, one hit, okay. Yep, if I make a profit off those copper ingots, then yeah, I have unlimited money and unlimited resources. <laughs> oh, what's a blue? Oh, new blue thing! Aquamarine. Starting to get far enough in where there's new resources. Alright, it's a uh, new day and we got paid 2,210 coins. So now we're at 3,000. So we did make a profit. And I was mining the entire time. So I can do that again. So let's go ahead and shove nine more on there. There we go. And I got two iron ingots so I can make an upgraded pickaxe. If I press and hold F, I use a special ability to smash a small area and it costs mana? So let's say I have like this here. Do I just press F? Oh, well, I mean, that's, that's something. Oh, okay, now I can just one hit those. What about iron? How long does it take to break you? Two hits, all right. So I think it's safe to say that now that I have unlimited money and unlimited food, uh, I can do whatever the fuck I want. Oh my God. Oh, I just, I'm getting four copper now. That's even better. It makes this so much easier. Check this shit out. God damn it, God bless. The game is now officially on easy mode. I no longer have to worry about anything. Yep, and now that I'm down here with the iron again, I, I get three iron, four copper per, and all of this peridot, peridot, whatever. Yeah, right now I'm an unstoppable machine. I'm on the tracks, I'm going down them, and I ain't stopping anytime soon, gotta say. Oh, this is gonna be satisfying, watch this. Oh yeah, oh, give me all that. I'm starting to get the feeling that by the end of this day, I'm gonna have so much iron and copper, I don't know what to do with it besides sell it. I'm gonna be at a point where I'm gonna want for nothing. So I'm getting the feeling that floor 15 is the highest I can go because it's like locked locked with a key. So I'm just gonna head home, make a whole shit ton of ingots and sell them and then see how much money we make tomorrow. So only 17.50, huh? Okay. I mean, we're still we still went up money. I only ate five yesterday, so I still made a profit and I used less food. Whenever the iron ingots are done, I'll be able to upgrade all the rest of my items as well. And then kind of just rinse and repeat. Infinite money, infinite resources, infinite food. Do some quests maybe to unlock more shit. And uh, yeah, I I'd have unlimited everything. Isn't that fun? I'm, I'm basically their god. And they should be thankful that I'm merciful.